Protector boats are manufactured in Auckland, New Zealand by Rayglass Boats. Rayglass has long been recognized as the premier sport boat manufacturer in a country that is respected globally for its boat engineering. Since 1999, Protect USA has successfully supported the Rayglass tradition of excellence by providing access to this premium New Zealand line of multifunctional car boats. When we got this boat and started looking around and seeing the strength of the boat, the stainless steel that they used, the the hand-laid fiberglass hull with no core material in it. The boat was really built to take a beating. So that combination of quality design and quality of build made us say, maybe, maybe there's a lot of other people in the United States that would like to have this product. So we started up Protector USA. The Protector tubes are, are, uh, are glue attached. And you can see the cutout in the side of the cabin. This is where the hard side was in the, uh, in the old hard-sided design boat. And it's glue attached all the way around. Um, which, uh, which keeps everything secure and keeps the tube in a nice firm position so that it can provide some of that nice shock absorbing characteristic uh, on the boat. And you see handles like this all over the boat that are nice to be able to grab hold of. And, and you can actually mm -hmm. see how, how low the tube is relative uh, to the floor and the water, which makes it really easy to get on and off the boat if you're swimming. So the 35 Targa, we use the core molds for the 28 in the cabin, but it's actually quite a lot larger cabin design. It's been lifted up off the floor so that it's taller to give you good visibility over the bow, uh, but it's fundamentally set up with a, a similar configuration of, of twin leaning posts with a fold-up seat on the inside of the cabin and the two rear-facing quarter seats. One of the things that, uh, that this boat offers that's really nice is some great seating here in the middle of the floor so you have a nice community for people to gather and, and talk, but also the ability to walk around the back to be able to exit the boat without disturbing anybody. There's just lots of deck space on this boat. One of the features of this rear bench seat is that we wanted to incorporate a cooler in. And so each of these cushions is snapped down into place so that it's secure, but then lifts up so that you can put ice and drinks in here and there's a drain in it. This bench seat is completely removable. There's a quick release hinge pins there and two people can pretty easily pick it up and set it on the dock. One of the really nice features of the 35 is that the tube is separated from the cabin and there's room for somebody to go to the bow of the boat without having to walk through the center, have something to hold on without actually stepping up on the tube. And so it makes for a very safe move from the uh, back of the boat to the forward part of the boat. Down below here we have tool batteries and the bow thruster and our holding tank in a watertight compartment for easy access and maintenance of all those items. On this boat we have a windlass as part of the bow post with a touch foot controller here so that you can uh, retrieve the anchor by yourself standing up in the bow. Another option that goes along with a forward windlass is uh, a detachable a forward bowsprit with a roller. When it comes to electronics, um, we work with the buyer to help them select what will be best for their use on the boat, but we um, almost always put in to this really nice panel at least a 10-inch GPS for navigation. Um, often we add radar that can now be overlaid, and in addition, some other nice features that we make part of that package are, of course, a VHF radio for communication, as well as a stereo system that's usually customized as well. The control panel on the 35 is, is quite similar to the 28 with the addition of the small controller for your electric bow thruster to really make the boat pretty easy to dock. For both the 28 and 35 protector, we offer a full windshield design, the target top, as well as a three-quarter windshield, the target top. Three quarters, meaning three quarters of the opening here is glass with a nice handhold here. And then the remaining quarter of your visibility is covered with eyes and glass. It's removable. And it's not only removable entirely, but also in pieces. So it's not uncommon for, uncommon for someone to be out boating, decide he's a little bit warm and would like to open the boat up. He can easily unzip and then roll it on itself. And so now I'm out in the open air. Down below on the 35, protector is deceivingly large. You have a step down here, I'm six foot one, and I can step down in this cabin with plenty of headroom. There's two seven and a half foot bunks down below, and really some nice storage space with shelving here and on the other side. 
and then space beneath these cushions to store life jackets and other gear. Beneath this one cushion is where the head is. And with a privacy curtain for down below here and a holding tab mounted up forward, you have a, a hidden facility. Below in the panel here, you see the mounting of the stereo with the iPod holder with the easy access panel in case you have to get in there to do any work on it. Behind this panel is your access to your electronics, which makes it really, really easy for someone that's uh, troubleshooting a problem to, to be able to get in there and do their thing. Well, I don't want to bother locking the boat up, but I'd like to keep um, visibility of the down below on the boat away from anybody who might be interested. You have this nice roll down piece of canvas. This is a quick and easy way to close the boat up. Protected truly is a one of a kind boat from its construction through to its finish and more importantly its ride. If you haven't gotten out on a protector and seen what it can do, then you probably should. <laughs>